Hey everybody, I just want to make a quick video, give you a little insight through a divorce lawyer's lens. One of the most hotly contested areas in divorce is the valuation of a marital asset, okay? So if you own a bar or a restaurant, you know, it's difficult and hotly litigated area as to what the true value is, especially in 2020 and 2021 and maybe beyond. So if you are a restaurant owner and you're thinking about getting married, get a prenup, get a prenup, take the restaurant right out of the marital equation. Okay. You'll be happy because you don't know what the future holds. And if that restaurant is in the marital estate, and you're litigating the value of that restaurant for splitting up the marital estate in equitable distribution, let's say if you're in a jurisdiction that does it that way, holy smokes, I've seen craziness happen because you go one day from being very, very busy to being shut down through no fault of your own. So a prenup in most places, and speak to an attorney in your jurisdiction, will take that asset out of the marital equation. Now, if you are married and then you open a restaurant, well, you're going to have to speak to an attorney in your jurisdiction to figure out how to best preserve that for yourself if that was purchased with non-marital assets. But if you've been married for a long time and then take savings that were earned during the marriage and buy a restaurant or a bar, it's a marital asset, okay? Think, think before you rush into marriage, man, these laws just are ruthless uh, against ambitious people. So be smart out there, speak to local counsel. And a lot of times before you're married, if you have these kind of assets, a restaurant, a bar, a bowling alley, rental properties, you want them out of the marital estate. Then there's less to fight over and you don't have to worry about the valuation issues. Share this with someone who needs to see it. Be careful out there. That's you. I'm talking to you.